we've been in four, we've won three. Of course, we got absolutely crucified for the one we lost. Um, and that's always going to be the case because it's outcome based. We refined that process a little bit. We have more regular penalty takers in the squad now than we had then and more that have been in shootouts. Um, but I think we've had a really calm process. But having said all that, the players have to show the composure that they did. And for all of them, you know, so many little stories within that. Cole at his age coming into a game like that, taking the first. Bukayo, his history with it. You, you, you sort of dismiss Jude because he's now... <laughs> Um, you almost expect it, but that's still high pressure. Ivan coming on, knowing that you know one of the reasons we bought him was for that moment, and then Trent, who's stuck with the task. You know, he it, he could have easily thought his tournament was done, um, but I've kept talking to him about you know he's going to have moments. There's still a big part to play, and yeah, I'm super pleased for all of them. And of course, the goalkeeper will always make at least one save, so it gives us a chance. Yeah, a lot of our processes have been shared. <laughs> so, uh, But then our tactical plan for the game was also shared three days before. So we live in an amazing world where it's so difficult for us because any element of surprise you might have with the opponent is gone three days before the game. It's quite incredible, really. Well, I gave him a massive cuddle on the pitch. Um, he's a special boy. He's a dream to work with. Um, wonderful family. Um, and of course, you're pleased for everybody, but for him especially when, when his went in. So, yeah, that takes courage, but we have belief in him. You know, we, we had belief in him previously. He's now got a lot more experience of those pressure moments. And, um, yeah, his all-round performance was exceptional. You know, the, the detail of how he had to defend and track and be in the right positions it was very complex down that side of the pitch. And... Um, then to give us the outlet in, in those one against one situations, which we felt um, could be a real advantage for us. He, he did, he kept, kept that positive note. Um, so yeah, his, his performance was immense. They're, they're such a close group, you know, they're, they're all delivering and a night like tonight, you know, we don't win the penalty shootout without our backup goalkeepers playing such an important role in training. Uh, Henderson, Aaron Ramsdale, Tom Heaton, who's come with us, they're all involved in that process. And it's its those moments that bring the whole group together. They're, they're all delivering and they're all fighting for each other. You know, these are not normal football matches. These are national events with huge pressure, with really young men in, in the middle of it. Um, our team has been under enormous pressure from the start. They're doing so well, so well. We're not able to score a load of goals at the moment. But again, you know, we've played three teams that play back five. Very well organised defences. Pitches are a little bit bobbly. And so you, you sometimes you need the extra touch. And as you have the extra touch, the space is gone. So, yeah, it's not, it, none of it is easy. None of this stuff is easy. But we're in a third semi-final in four tournaments, you know, for the staff and players that have been involved in all of that that's yeah I think that's a pretty good achievement but it's not where we want it to end yeah every now and then you think surely there has to be some enjoyment in this job so um, if I can't enjoy that moment then yeah the whole thing's a waste of time really so um, I love the players I love being in that moment with them I took this job to try and improve English football not not the seniors when I first joined the Football Association. I wanted us to regain credibility on a world stage. So I can't deny that you know, when it's as personal as it's been the last few weeks, on a human level, that's quite difficult. But we're fighting. We're not going to stop fighting. And as I said, we're in another semi-final and we'll see where we can get to.